So, Paul, we talked earlier with the team and there was some hope that you guys were getting to Q3. It wasn't to be today. How do you feel after your qualifying session? It was close. <laughs> um, unfortunately, half a tenth would have put us five positions up the road nearly. Um, when you qualify 15, 6 tenths of the quickest time of that session, uh, that's, that's quite a, a blow. But anyway, um, we're showing good signs. Uh, I was quite a bit quicker than Nico, which is good. It showed that I got as much as I could out of the car. Um, but again, it's going to make the race difficult tomorrow. We need to try and focus on going forward. Uh, the setup we've chosen is, does seem strong in a race condition. So um, tomorrow we should be fairly optimistic that we can try and go forward, challenge some of the teams up front. But we are where we are at the moment. Uh, life's difficult, um, but hopefully come European season when we get some bigger upgrades um, that the gain from this car, um, we'll be going certainly challenging even the bigger teams in Q3. So Bruno, you qualify in 14th. Given that your race pace is stronger, do you feel fairly confident ahead of tomorrow's race? Well, it should be okay. Uh, this is a track that uh, for sure didn't favour our car in terms of qualifying performance. Uh, the rest zones are uh, quite uh, beneficial here. So um, it was a very close session as well, probably the closest of the year so far. And it makes it difficult. So if you make a small error in your lap, you pay for with a few positions. So I think we're, we're okay for tomorrow. We have a good race car and hopefully we can move forwards. And what happened with you and De La Rosa? Well, Pedro, uh, unfortunately didn't move out of the way on his out lap and I was on a really good lap so I kind of lost three tenths could have been a, a pretty good lap so you know it's, a, it's one of those things but fortunately we managed to to, to go through to Q2 and uh, then try to fight for Q3. Felipe you staved off challenge after challenge but just missed out on getting through to the last qualifying session how do you feel ahead of tomorrow? Yeah I think it was close I mean it was close to achieve you know the Q3 it was not possible but I mean for a bit you know uh, I think that's uh, important you know, uh, to improve the car step by step. Uh, last qualifying I was P13, this time P12, so I hope we can uh, be in a good situation for tomorrow in the race. So talking of improving the car step by step, how co confident are you with the upgrades? How competitive can you be tomorrow? Well, I hope more than today. So if we are more than today, maybe we are able to fight for the points, hope good points, so I think that's uh, the target for tomorrow.